and uh, that's ready. All right, I'll take, I'll pop the stone out again, being careful not to deform it at all. <clears throat> when I took these off the anvil after getting rid of the solder marks, so you couldn't see the, the solder where the bezel was put together, I flattened it this way. And it's nice and flat already, but what I'm going to do here is just, it's just for cleaning purposes only. So uh, a few extra strokes. And she's ready. All right, I have a piece of uh, stainless steel mesh. I'll put it on my fire brick. I'll set this up on top of it. Try to get it nice and level. And uh, this time you can go ahead and flex your plate using a uh, handy flux or high temperature flux. It comes by different names. Uh, you can put a nice copious amount of flux on here. Don't be bashful. I like to completely cover the uh, the piece. It helps with the fire scale. Okay, and then we'll we'll take flux on this bottom surface, and we'll coat that. So I'll be absolutely sure that the surface that I need to solder to has had flux been applied to it. I'll set it on the uh, little piece of flat plate, making sure it's centered. Now I've got about a sixteenth inch all the way around. Since this is a multi-solder project, we're going to be using a uh, medium solder now, because we used a, a high heat solder earlier. Medium solder melts at about 1275. I like to cut my chips about a sixteenth of an inch by a sixteenth of an inch. For a project like this, I'll cut about seven or eight little chips. General rule of thumb, a sixteenth of an inch by sixteenth of an inch bit of solder will cover five sixteenths inch of linear bezel. Now, uh, I like my solder to be coated with flux as well. I'll make sure that they get the, all these little chips get coated in solder before we put them in there. Okay. Now what I'll do is I'll take the chips and I'll put them on the plate inside the bezel and right up against the bezel. And I'll set them about a quarter inch apart. Now the reason why we're doing that is because if a chip of solder will cover five sixteenths of an inch, I want to be just a little bit more than I need. Better to be just a hair more than a hair less. The extra solder will will pull up inside the bezel. You won't it's so little you won't even notice it when you set the stone. And that way it ensures absolutely that when you put heat to it that there's enough solder there to go all the way around the bezel. All right, that's ready. Uh, we're gonna, you could let this dry overnight, but we're going to take our hair dryer and uh, dry it.